Everyone, look, it's Minecraft's biggest menace. He's back for another season of survival. We are back for season three of survival. Super excited. Um, another year of survival. If you're new to this kind of survival uh, series. So in the first season, uh, we built uh, this massive mega base. And in the second one, we didn't get to finish it. We ran out of time. This is our base here. This season, though, we are going to be going to the fullest. We are going to complete it. Um, I have a lot of plans as well. Lots of different ideas. So uh, this will be a very long series. We are going to have to start slow, though. It is just the first day. And that means we need our basic materials. Like a little tiny, tiny starter house. We have agreed that... I will build the house and that Steve will go out, collect us some wool for beds and some food so we can eat and then teamwork. We got to have to, we got to team up first before we kind of split off and do our own thing. We have a great spot to build, I found. And what I want to do is because usually in the other seasons, I just ignore the, the first, like the first set of tools here. I'm going to try my best to save them use them to the fullest but without breaking them and then that way i'll have like kind of a little trophy case for like the first i think i'll treat our starter base as like the museum of first pretty much so but everything that we got first in there like first you know set of tools in this case everything will go into that house so that way it'll be um something to remember we're starting to build the house now it's turning nighttime, and we have no beds. So we are going to have to work through the night and hope we don't die. Um, I really hope we don't die. Although, I just want to get... If I put some walls up, at least, like, if mobs are coming around, we can be protected. I don't know how high I'm supposed to go with the walls. Because it's just going to be a little, little starter base. But we're just going to set it to this high and... Hopefully that's it. Again, it's just a little starter base, so it needs to look just decent. I have to go and get some wool because we're not doing well. We just got exploded by a creeper, and we're getting chased. So we need to look for something. I will get sugarcane, though. We will need sugarcane for our sugarcane farm, which we want to get an enchanting table for. I'm getting chased. I'm going to die. Yep. So, at least, all of our stuff should still be there. Unless we just can't get to it. A sheep. We gotta get the sheep. Because we need the wool. There we go. Kill him by stick. This guy wants a piece of my stick. Sheep. Now there's two. I gotta go around them. I need my stuff. Go away. Okay. So that's where the creeper blew up. At least it wasn't at the house. Because if it was at the house... That would have sucked. At least when the creeper blew up, not at the house, it just blew up my body. So, the house is intact, though, and that's what's important, not myself. Uh, is our stuff still here? Please say it's still here. Yep, it's all still here. Perfect. We just need some sand now to get some glass. And the house is coming along. We're going to use slabs, I think. Because it's, well, a lot cheaper than the whole block. It also looks the exact same as if I just used the whole block instead. So we have pretty much two sides. So I got my stuff on uh, one chest. Steve's stuff is in the other chest. And we're going to pretty much have two sides to this house. We're just going to split 50-50. We need some stone as well. We need a lot of cobblestone for this build as well. I'm going to make the most expensive roof ever. The, the roof is going to cost more than the house itself. It has become the second night. And we still don't have beds, so we are, uh, we're in trouble again. But at least the house is done. Two-thirds done. We're using oak stairs in between the two uh, side cobblestones. We got glass paint. I want you to paint the whole block. I think it'll look a lot nicer than just the whole block. I'm even putting some stairs on the inside too, just so the roof gets extra... Extra decorations up in here. And the house is pretty much done. We just, we're just missing the beds is what we're missing. We have not found six sheep. 
I don't understand how we haven't found six sheep. But it is a, it's a struggle. It, I don't understand why it's so much of a struggle. Because sheep are just not spawning. It's like they almost know we want to kill them and then use them so we can make some beds. We just need the sheep. We got our wool. We got it. Perfect. We have it all. Not any more wood first. Yes, we got two beds. So Steve will be on the right and I will be on the left. We'll split the room 50-50. Now on my side, I put up, so my my first, right, as, a muse as the museum thing. So I have my first set of tools. The sword broke, unfortunately. Um, so that's a shame, but that's the first mob I killed was a zombie. Um, we do want, where is my, here we go, eight sticks. When we do want, so technically, this is the first bow that we used. So put that on the wall. We'll put the first arrow we used, well, the first arrow we got right beside it. And the house is done. That is episode number one of survival. Thank you all for watching. The mega base will be a lot of stone. So uh, we're, it's going to take some time to get all the stone. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.